Cheeto offense. Lots of things have been a struggle for this group. You know, throw for it across the middle into traffic, and the catch is made by Deontay Johnson. First down across the 40. Operating with some tempo here in third and four. Pressure delivered across the middle and almost intercepted Marcus Williams from his deep safety spot was tracking that down But it just slipped off his hands Better be aware of number 90 looking for his 18th sack this season battling for the sack title with Hendrickson of the Bengals And off the edge he gets near the quarterback the ball out quickly but off the hands of Justice Hill The speedy running back had it right there. It was a nice throw Porter was in coverage he said the introduction was a production all in and of itself, and it was. He used to light this, this stadium up from the get-go. Rudolph kind of looks the snap into his hands and flips it in the flat. And around the edge, Warren flashing his speed on a sloppy track all the way into Baltimore territory. Got a nice block from Connor Hayward. They fake it to Warren. Rudolph on the move, now flips it underneath to one of those tight ends. Hayward awkwardly grabs it and is able to pivot. Flip those hips and get the first down inside the 35. And Warren's gotten, I think, more physical just with the presence of Harris. Yeah, he's a different type of runner. Much more explosive in a short area. But not afraid the body slam dudes. Throw it down underneath, and that's Deontay Johnson's third catch already as the Steelers move the ball close to the red zone here. Just gets it off. Harris dives and scores. And the Steelers with a powerful drive. 12 plays. 76 yards to draw first blood on the road. Harris carrying the load. He's taking Lamar to a completely different level. Gordon again near the marker. Yeah, Harbaugh's been around for a long time, as we said. Really felt like it was a... There's a personal connection between these two, between John Harbaugh and Lamar Jackson. And he wants to see to it that this young man reaches his potential. Gordon loses the football to the Ravens. Pick up their first first down. They fumble it away. And pitch... Meanwhile, the Steelers from the 45. No problem with their running game so far. Najee Harris just ran through a tackle and runs out of bounds. Interesting, like you see the safety already creeping over. The corner comes up, safety creeps over. Rudolph dumps it down to Warren again. And he'll be tackled short of the marker. So, a 9 of 11 star. Ravens say the ball came out at the tackle. Huge pile up. Baltimore's convinced they have it. No signal yet. And it is going to be a fumble recovery by Millette. That on your screen is the reason why he's the coordinator right now. Because he takes Lamar and gives him the chance to do that. There's a third down throw right at the marker. The catch is made by Isaiah Likely, who's been a big part of this offense resurgence. When you add Odell Beckham and Zay Flowers, and Rashad Bateman stays healthy, this is what happens. And there's a sack swarming in. And getting after the quarterback is... Mark Robinson from his linebacker position, the first sack of the day. More like a sparkler. It took some time to get things going, click this season. Huntley on the move, escapes the pressure. A long way to go to get the marker and will just fall down short of it at the 47. This has not been one that Todd Munkin would like to put in the time capsule so far. They have five yards passing. And finally a downfield pitch and a catch. And been the guy he's looked for from Seattle in the offseason. Edwards through a crease, makes a cut, and Gus the bus rolls down inside the 25 from nowhere as Ravens offense has come to life. The crowd the line on second and 12, Huntley back over the middle, and the catch is made. And Isaiah likely dives to the end zone. Prime move. Known as one of the better guys to work against the zone, and he's found some spot along the sidelines. And the former Penn State tight end backpedaling ball pops right up in the air, bouncing around and recovered. Pressure closing again. That ball's knocked out loose again, and the Ravens fall on it. Roderick Washington makes the recovery. It has to continue to operate efficiently like they have over the past few weeks. Run the football. Don't turn it over. Don't hold on to it. Doesn't get rid of the ball there. Brought down by T.J. Watt, who does have 
Sack number 18 on the season and takes over the league lead. It's third and long. Meantime, Pittsburgh trying to make these games tomorrow meaningful. And Najee Harris begins the draw by barreling into Baltimore territory as he's getting closer to 100 yards or 1,000 yards for the season. 15 more there. I don't want him holding it any longer than he has. Bobble snap there just falls on it. Yeah. Pittsburgh. Very, very sketchy on offense. The last four possessions going backward. Huntley is swarmed and sacked. You could see it coming as T.J. Watt and Cam Hayward both got there. Harris downhill. Grabbed him up near the helmet. I don't see the flag. It's the first down yardage. Harris motions out empty backfield. And no chance to get the ball away. Off the blitz, Trent Simpson, the rookie, makes a sack. I wouldn't want to do it too much. I would be worried, quite honestly, about them trying to throw the football between the numbers. Gotcha. Straight back, there is a pass between the numbers as they find the tight end, Charlie Kohler, and move the six to the 30. Let's see if they can hold up here in the last 19 minutes. Huntley on the move, flips it late over the middle, and it's complete. Out near midfield to Nelson Aguilar. T.J. Watt makes his way toward the locker room. I hate to, to be see walking that. okay. Quarterback sneak inside run here to get a first down. He said they hand it off, and the first touch of the game is Pickens on an end around of all things. And he does turn the corner and <laughs> beginning the fourth. Third and four. Ravens bring some pressure. It's picked up and down the middle. The catch is made by Deontay Johnson. They will not catch him. Pittsburgh takes the lead. 71 yard strike. Crossing routes. On third and six, a completion and just backing his way for the first time is Aguilar. He's very close. There it is, right? So there they ran a little bit of zone coverage game. You see him right here rushing from the defensive left. Third and six. Once again, it's Aguilar. They try to find him over the middle. And he's had back-to-back -back third down catches. They move the ball. It's Aguilar motioning into the slot, running him right across the middle. They take a look that way. But instead, had to pitch it downfield, and it bounces short in front of Wallace. Tight throws in bad weather. High punt. Field it inside the 10. Austin. Can he get around the corner? He does. Makes the cut. And... Big return out across the 40-yard line. Harris is back in there on this third and five. Rudolph from the pocket flips it to him. Najee will be dropped for a loss. Simpson back-to-back. -back. Nice plays in the Ravens defense. Now grouping on the field from the Pittsburgh defense. Again, it's a run to Edwards. It does. Move to six. Lost the football. Pittsburgh's got it. The ball comes loose. It was punched out. It was his 20th carry today. He's number 21. There it is. Downhill again after a sidestep. A low tackle doesn't bring him down. In fact, they never do bring him down. They just blow the whistle. Well, Rudolph on the run will under an extended handoff to Harris who <laughs> makes the catch and is knocked out. It'll be first and goal. And you know what they were thinking? They were thinking, hey, Baltimore. Third and goal. It, it, the end around, and the big man is stopped by Simpson. And that's perfect for Pittsburgh. Ends in only three, but they take about four and a half minutes off the clock. Taking nine plays to go just 25 yards. And he always knows how to push the right buttons. That says all, that says it all right there. And Hill. Finally, a chance to flash his speed. Takes the short pass and races out near midfield. Their 10th win. Huntley able to scramble and dodge a tackler and dive forward for a first down. So that will be the two-minute warning. Huntley grabs the high snap and steps up. Looks to take off again. He's found some running room right up the middle. And we'll just fall down. It's a first down. Quickly get out of bounds if you're a pass catcher. 
And they work the middle. No chance to get out of bounds as Wallace will again get a first out of the 15 as the clock runs. Put this game away. Three receivers punch to the left. Huntley running out of time. And that will fall down. Takes a sack back at the 24. Marcus Golden jumped on him. Gets fourth down in the clock. Tucker will step up and try to Steelers hands team the bunts along the ground and on a slippery day it's going to be recovered by Pittsburgh they find a way to make the quarterback change win three in a row two against division rivals and they at least have given themselves a shot I'm about 20 straight seasons finishing 500 or better as an organization <laughs> Mike's but been here for 17 of them I mean that's that's incredible.